What is up, everybody? Welcome to another brand new video. This is Searching for Hits with Eric, and I am Eric. And today, we have something a little different for you. We have three grab bags from uh, one of the card stores in Cooperstown, New York, home of the Baseball Hall of Fame. Uh, my cousin was up there, stopped in a couple of shops for me. These are directly from 7th Inning Stretch, which is near Doubleday Field. These are their three offerings, a $7.99 offering for our uh, 100 cards, $9.99 for 250 and then the Big Mama 500 card bag. Um, so we'll open these up and see if they are worth the money. Uh, I also have from Mickey's Place a $25 mystery box, which we will get into possibly in another video, um, since this might take a little while. So we'll start with the cheapest of the three and work our way up to see what we could find. We are looking for $7.99 worth of value in this first mystery bag here. And let's get into it. If you have not subscribed already, please do so. Love to have you along for more videos. Also, make sure you leave a like and a comment. Let me know if you think these were worth their money. Again, first bag, $7.95. And I'm seeing a lot of junk wax already, which I was hoping it wouldn't be, but kind of not surprised that it is. I do see some sleeved cards, though, which gets me excited. And there's some Bowmans here, so all right. It might be a nice mix. Let's see what we got. Again, this one was $7.99. Let's see what we got. First little stack, we have a Raul Mondese from Upper Deck uh, 95. We got an Upper Deck Predictor, Ken Caminiti card, some sort of game card. Got some Bowman firsts, Jake Agnos. These are 2018, I believe. No, 2020. Uh, Matt Mercer first, and Brock Burke, who's up in the majors. So those aren't bad. We're going to put those aside. Three Bowman firsts of prospects that are still potentially around. Robin Yount, he's a Hall of Famer from 90 tops. Got some more Bowmans here. I see some firsts. That's good. Max Muncy, that's from 2021, I believe. Nope, that's 2020 also. These are 2017. The Bowman designs can be a little confusing. That's Alex Spears first. Uh, Evan Longoria, Willie Adamas. There's a Travis Demerit. So let me put my, put my firsts aside at least. And my rookies, Travis Demerit. see what else we got here. They're all, all different directions. Uh, Zach Granite, rookie card, and Justin Ailman, first. Got a Matt Olson from Donruss. Eric Hosmer, that's going to be from Stadium Club 2019. We have a top prospects of nobody in particular. I do not know any of those four. Uh, we have an 87 Tops Wally Joyner card. That's pretty cool. Like that card when I was a kid. Wally Joyner Gold Cup. Got some more Bowman. Ryan Nelson. Alec Marsh first. And Shervian Newton, who I do not know. I'm not familiar with him. Uh, we have a Blas Miner rookie card from Fleer Ultra. Uh, Russ Swan, top low, uh, sleeved for some reason. There's a Hyunjin Ryu. Best of the best, Todd Walker. That's going to be a minor league card of Todd Walker. Spent some time in the New York Mets organization. Kind of cool. Sandy Alomar, decent player. That's his Gold Cup rookie card. Got some more junk wax. We've got a, uh, Lion Richardson, first Bowman. Jason Arnold, prospect card. It's 
So it's a mix of junk wax and, and other stuff. Cameron Misner first. Lee Stevens. Richard Hidalgo prospect card. He had some good years. Hans Kraus, prospect card from Bowman. He's up in the majors with the Phillies. Jose Cruz. Let's see what we got here. Walt Weiss and Xavier Warren first. Walt Weiss. Played in at least one, maybe two World Series with the Oakland A's. Darian Cruz first. Bruin Hicklin. And Blaze Alexander, who I believe was a first round pick. Um, I do not see it. Yeah, he was a first rounder, round one, 32nd or 33rd overall. So, got a first rounder. Let's see what else we got here. These are all backwards, not all of them. All right, we have a David Calabrese first. We have. A gold draft pick of Jimmy Barron, who I do not remember. Dennis Reyes. Matt Dice, first. Uh, Corey Koski and Doug Mankiewicz. Both had okay careers. Aaron Shortridge. Yusei Kikuchi and Nick Garcia. Short Ridge is a prospect card. Dave Henderson. Joran Adams and Riley are Alex Young. Alex Young first. All right, let's see what else we got here. Not too bad for $7.99. There's a Deion Sanders who I always liked. Two-way player, Marquise Grissom. There's Jason Lane. Got some more Bowman here. Geraldo Perdomo, prospect card. He's up in the majors. Dylan Dingler, Luke Little. Three more good prospects. Ryan Domit, prospect card. Had a couple of decent years. Uh, Troy Percival. What is this? I don't even know what, what card this is. It's a minor league card of Troy Percival. 1993. He was a very, very good reliever. Chris Bryant. Kevin Pillar. Sandy Alomar. Reggie Jefferson. There's Hall of Famer Paul Mahler with the uh, with the pop-up card. Lucas Giolito. Nice pitcher right there. J.D. Martin. Darren Dalton. Yeah, you mine uh, Robin Ventura, classic. It's not a minor league card, is it? No, that's an 89, though, so that's a, technically a rookie card. Ryan Weathers, son of Dave Weathers. Hankins, Ryan Garcia, Matt Mercer. Lots of prospects here. Freitas Nova, Mateo. Got Dan Vogelback. Matthew Lipitor is a good one, good pitcher. Jordan Yamamoto, rookie. Not sure where he is now. Kevin Apier. Got an Andrew Benatendi. Getting a shower with the Red Sox. It's his second year card. Here's our last little stack from that $7.99 pack. Um, pretty good. Pretty good stuff. Let's see what we finish off with. We got a... Uh, who is that? Matt Walbeck. I do not remember him. Eric Karos, former Rookie of the Year. Ethan Small, first Bowman. And that Alex Gonzalez, for some reason, sleeved up. There's another Dylan Dingler, first Bowman. Travis Fryman and Kyle Freeland. Kyle Freeland's a good young pitcher. All right, we go. let's get these turned around. Josh Hader. Great reliever, Josh Hader. There's Shane Beaver and Anthony Rendon. 
We have Jack Little first, Christian Cairo, Seth Johnson, Freudus Nova again, Matt Canton, Cantorino, Graham Stinson, lots of first Bowmans here. Jameson and D.L. Hall. So big pile of prospects. What else do we have? We got Robert Tyler. These are 2017. Billy McKinney prospect card and a Dom Smith prospect card who is no longer with the Mets. We have a Chris Gomez. Another Matthew Lipitor, Logan Driscoll, Ornelas, Jimmy Lewis, Vince Fernandez. There's Jackson Coar prospect card. Darian Cruz, Will Wilson, Alejandro Kirk. That's a minor league prospect card. Jake Mangum. And our final card of this pack is going to be a Brooks Kieschnick star rookie card. So... I don't know, for eight bucks, $7.95, that's not bad. I will take that stack of rookies and prospects, as well as some Hall of Famers here, for $7.95. I think that was a decent deal, but I'd love to hear from you guys. What do you think? Was that worth the $8? Now, let's move up here to the $9.95 one. So we're looking for about $10 in value. And here we go. And this one looks more like junk wax than the first one. So I'm not quite sure what to expect. Well, there's a there's a Bowman. So it's a mix like the first one. There's our two stacks. Let's see what we have in here. I'm going to go a little quicker through the junk wax if they're not all in a million different directions. It's Tim Raines. He's a Hall of Famer. Cards are sticking together. We got a football card that made its way in here. Hall of Famer Reggie White. Pretty interesting. Crook. Strawberry towards the end of his career. What do we have here? Moises Alou. Good player. Thought that was a parallel, but it is not. Some 88 Donruss. 90 Fleer, which is the... Or 91 Fleer, which is probably my least... Favorite set, followed closely by this Donra set. Some 87 tops. And let's see what we got here. It is a Shannon Stewart from Certified. Nothing too crazy there. Uh, we have, who is that? Jaime Navarro. Um, don't know what this is. But we're not going to dwell on it. There's an Alex Reyes rookie card. We'll put that in our decent pile. Actually, the first card I'm putting, a, putting aside from this. Uh, Mad Bum from Chronicles. So $10 for this one. And so far, I am, I am less impressed than the $7.95 pack. Hopefully, it'll turn around a little bit. Tom Hankey. Lot of junk wax. Junk wax, junk wax. Bo Burrows, put that as a prospect card. We got Sean Casey from Donruss Classics. There's a Bowman Chrome of Bobby Bradley. It's a prospect card of Bobby Bradley. I guess we'll put that aside. He's all right. All right, and that'll do it for. Our first little stack there. Let's see what we got going on next. More junk wax. Dave Allison. Let's see what we got here. Jimmy Key. Sean Reed Foley prospect card. William Van Landingham. Todd Zeal, some more 89 tops. Just looking to see if there are any Hall of Famers, which I do not see. Got a White Sox sticker. 
Nef Tali uh, Nef Nefi Perez, Andy Bennis. Ah, oh, Jake Arrieta. We have a first of Orm Gibson, who I'm not familiar with. All right, what do we got here? It is a Trevor Story. Juan Guzman. Steven Gonzalez. I think he's up in the majors. Craig Kimbrell. So we're getting veterans. Uh, Jan Moncada, 80. Uh, second year Jan Moncada. 81 tops design there. Put that aside. That's a cool card. Charlie Blackman. Joe Oliver. There's another Mad Bum from Chronicles. So we're getting some uh, some repeats. There's a 2019 Madison Bumgardner. Ozzie Guillen. Get these spun around here. Jose Valverde. There's a gold card. Tyler Baum and Chris Shaw. Prospect cards, Gagne. Yeah, I'll tell you, I'm not feeling this my uh, $10 pack at all. Got another basketball card mixed in here. Chuck Finley. Corey Snyder, who I did not like when I was a kid. I do not know why. Lloyd, a lot of junk wax. There's Nolan Arenado when he was back in, with the Rockies. Third or fourth year card. Cecil Fielder had a great career. Uh, who is this? Brandon Back. Look at this. What happened to Willie Randolph? Someone was hungry and took a bite out of him. Johnny Franco. Like John Franco a lot. There's Madison Bumgardner from Heritage 2016. And that's about it for the first stack. So really, really weak first half of the $10 box. Let's see what we got in the second half. Hopefully something a little better. Steven Piscotti, that's a uh, not a rookie or anything. Dan Wilson, Ryan Valade. It's a Chrome Prospect card. Aramis Aidman. Chris Young. Yeah, a few good years. Power Bat. And Cheryl. Thomas Eshelman. I think he had a cup of coffee in the majors. Tim Hudson. It's from 2002, early Tim Hudson. Good pitcher, had a good career. Jay Buhner. There's another Chronicles of Madison Bumgardner. Someone, someone liked Mad Bum and PC'd them before turning their collection over to this store. Josh Morgan. A prospect card. Do not not familiar with him. Jan Moncada, second year card. Jan Moncada again. Rich Becker. It's another one of those. Uh, it's Bip Roberts. Another one of those. Not sure what these are. Don't know if I've ever seen that design before. All right, not a whole lot here. J.P. Howell, Dave Smith, who I hated as a kid. Don Zimmer, Mike K. 
Campbell Future Star All Junk Wax. So, my recommendation if you're in seventh inning stretch is to steer clear of the $10 packs. Go for the $8 packs. They were certainly better to us. Let's see what we got here. Jake Thompson. There's Francisco Lindor. That's an early Lindor, third year. It's not a rookie, but I do like that card. Kazasaki, he had a few good years. Hideo Nomo, another Japanese import. Tony Graffinino, there's Doc Gooden. Always like Doc Gooden. Jesus, Jose Vizcaino. Back into the junk wax. Hershiser, but again, all junk wax. Hall of Famer Tim Raines was in there. And here's the last little stack. Um, let's see if there's anything good in this last little bit here. Troy Neal. Got another football card mixed in. It's Tony Casillas. Colby Allard, rookie. Prospect card of Courtney Hawkins as well. Luis Arcia. Digpin. Some stadium club from back in the early 90s. And we're going to finish it off with more junk wax. There's Mike Lansing from Stadium Club. And that will do it. So first one was good. Second one, not so good. As you can see, the good pile is far bigger from the $8 pack than the $10 pack. All right, now here is the quote unquote big mama. So let's see what we got here. This is the $20 pack. Hopefully we'll get some good stuff in here. It is jam packed. Let's see if we can get these cards out of here. Jam-packed with what looks like junk wax. I see a lot of, a lot of Donruss. And here we go. So there's the third and final box and, uh, or third and final bag. Let's see what we got out of here. Palmero from 89 score. Harnish. Chad Curtis. There's Robbie Alomar. He's a Hall of Famer. Chris Gwynn. And Vinny Castilla. Doug Drabeck. Rusty Meacham. Tim Scott. 89 tops. 89 to uh, Donruss, excuse me. Pat Sheridan. Got a Jeff Facero mixed in here. This is all junk wax. 89. We got a Nate McClouth mixed in here. That's uh, from 2009. 2009 Upper Deck Sweet Spot. Nothing too exciting though. Blankenship. We got a uh, Team Leaders card. I don't think I'm going to find a Griffey Jr. rookie in here, but you never know. Otis Nixon. Just a bunch of commons.
Bob Walk. And the Scott McGregor 85 tops. Harold Reynolds. Dontrell Willis. A piece of history. When he was with the Detroit Tigers. Harnish. Matt Williams, who had a great run, the rookie home run record, cut short by the strike. Rob Deer, oh dear. Charles Johnson. Yeah, this is getting discouraging. Not much going on in this at all. Charles Nagy, Giovanni Soto, Ray Knight. Let's see what else we got. There's Kurt Schilling. From Leaf 2004. Schilling, good player. Not in the Hall of Fame, may never make the Hall of Fame. And hoping to find something else decent. Coming up on some shiny cards. We got here a Phil Nevin. It's from Tops. I don't know what that is. I'm not sure which set this is. Carlos Lee. Jason Bay. Tops total. Just a lot of junk wax commons. Well, you want to get rid of your commons? That's the way to do it. You put together some mystery packs. There's Doc Good and Bowman, 91. Mike Hampton, top's finest hurlers insert. From two thousand, from ninety seven, actually, an early tops finest. It's kind of a cool card. You don't see those too too often. All right, getting down to the bottom of the first stack. Two big stacks in this bag. Thank you so much for watching. Hope uh, hope you're enjoying thumbing through these. Wish they were a little more exciting, but perhaps the one from Mickey's place will be a little better. Pat Listash. Let's see. Flip these over. Jimmy Key. They're just in every direction. Ron Darling and Todd Jones. Dan Maselli, rookie card. Pat Kelly. Kevin Young, upper deck. Gibson, would be great to find a Griffey, but I do not expect it. Pretty sure these have been picked over many times over. 
Last couple of cards. It's the Grandy Man, Curtis Granderson. Kind of a cool card. Both Yankees and Mets fans appreciate the great work Granderson did. There's Boggs. He's a, he's a Hall of Famer, at least. Ray McDavid. There's Hall of Famer Gary Carter, Gary the Kid Carter, Tony Pena, Ben McDonald, there's Hanley Ramirez, we had some good years Hanley Ramirez, certainly not Going to be a Hall of Famer, but Hall of Very Good. And we're getting down to the last few cards of the first stack without a whole lot to show for it. Jason Giacomi, rookie card. I do not remember Jason Giacomi. All right, moving on to the next stack here. Trying to go through them quickly, but they keep sticking. Mike Maddox, brother of Greg Maddox. There's Randy Johnson. That's a cool card. Studio Randy Johnson. He is a Hall of Famer. Robin Ventura. Tim Belcher. There's another Wade Boggs. From 90 Fleer. Mike Young. So they're mixing in some Hall of Famers at least. Get these turned around. Can't tell how far down they go. Let's turn it around right there. There's Hall of Famer Raleigh Fingers. It's kind of beat up card though, so I'm not even gonna put that aside. Manny Trio. Darren Holmes. Daryl Strawberry. Forgot he was with the Giants for a Hot Minute, Harold Baines, Hall of Famer, Eric Young and Mark Redman, and some more 89 Donruss. We got a Minnesota Twins team lineup. Big Poppy Ortiz with the Twins. So this is an old, this is 2000. That's pretty cool. Got David Ortiz on there when he was with the Minnesota Twins as a prospect. So that's actually a pretty cool card. That's probably the best card of this box, of this bag. Let's see what else we got in here. Someone didn't realize that, uh, that that was a Big Poppy prospect card. Lee Smith's a Hall of Famer. Howard Johnson, my favorite player, even though it's all creased. It's pretty horrible. Ugeth Urbina. What do we have here? It's a Topps Gallery Exhibitions, Dante Bichette. It's a pretty cool card. I don't know if I've ever seen that design. Kind of cool. Donald Harris. What else we have as we work our way through the final stack? Tarnish.
Pedro Guerrero, so 89 tops, 89 Donruss. Dave Winfield, have to have to recognize big Dave Winfield. He's a Hall of Famer. Roger Saltheld. Kenny Rogers. Had a pretty decent career. Chris Snowpack. Got some some more upper deck sweet spot cards. Matt Kemp and BJ Upton. Decent players, not rookie cards though, so not too big a deal. Wally Joyner's second year card was in there. Alomar again. For that stack, so two more little little stacks, and we should be done with this. Um, Seven ninety five pack, still uh, still biggest bang for the buck. Grady Sizemore and Justin Upton. It's Justin Upton's rookie, I think. So we'll put that aside. He's a good player. Was a good player. What else do we have? Luis Gonzalez, he was a World Series hero. Jeff Blauser. Torrey Hunter. He had a great career, Torrey Hunter. Paul Molitor, Hall of Famer. Todd Van Poppel. Juan Samuel. Got some 95 Donruss mixed in here. And not much else going on in this pile. There's a Rod Carew. Again, condition is awful. But he is a Hall of Famer, so we'll point it out. Al Martin. Just a lot of commons, a lot of junk wax. Travis Fryman. Robbie Thompson and some more. 89 Donruss, which are not Griffey's. All right, last pile. Let's see what we have. There's George Brett Hall of Famer. Scott Coolbaugh. Cecil Fielder sticking behind. else of note. Terry Mulholland, who once threw a no-hitter. Ray Langford. Ken Hill. There's Gary Carter again. Got a sport flick of Brett Saberhagen from 1986. Second year, Brett Saberhagen. Got a Tim Wallach. Um, fan favorite buyback card, Tim Wallach. Not even original. Brian Jensen. Got a Maglio Ordonez. Fleer Triple Crown. And what else do we have? Get 
some of these flipped around. Dean Palmer. Got a Roy Halladay from Fleer Tradition, maybe. Halladay, Hall of Famer. Pat Mahomes, father of Super Bowl MVP Patrick Mahomes. And we'll finish up the last little pile here. Corey Kosky, Steve Cook, and back into the junk wax to finish it off. Paul Wagner. And we are gonna finish it off with a little run of Donruss 95 and a card chilling rookie at the end. All right. So Kurt Schilling rookie popping out at the end. Um, still, even with that, the $20 one was a bust. So um, you're in Cooperstown and you want to pick something up, I recommend the $7.95 pack. Buy a few of them. Um, $19.99 and $9.99, I would avoid. So that's my recommendation. Love to hear your feedback. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time on Searching for Hits with Eric.